Hey internet, welcome back to my channel. Um, it has been a little while since I've uploaded on this channel, like three months, no, two months. Yeah, once one of December was the last one. Um, it's been a little while. I'm gonna try and do this all in one take, so it's gonna be a really rambly vlog cause I don't want to spend too much time editing this video. Um, felt like I had to come on here and just do a little bit of an update because I know there's some people that watch this, like two people, <laughs> but um, I did feel like I wanted to at least address things like my fourth trimester video, which I said I was going to upload. I'm not going to upload. Let me explain why, because I feel like there's been a lot going on and um, I haven't really spoken about it anywhere online. And this feels like a good place to talk about it. So I'm just going to be fully transparent. Um, rambly but anyways around November December last year after I got out of the fog of being a newborn newborn mom and actually had some headspace to start thinking because Bubs was taking more regular naps he was feeding faster so I wasn't like breastfeeding for like 45 minutes um it, like literally he, he does it like in three minutes now so I have a lot more of headspace to actually think and I realized that one of the things I really want for myself, what I've always wanted for myself, is I just want to be my own boss. Like I just want to decide my time, own timetable, um, manage myself. I don't, and that's the thing, I love my day job. It's actually a really good day job. I'm half excited to go back, half in that, like there is no other day job that I'd be more or less excited to. Like I'm actually really happy there. The only, reason I'm not looking forward to going back is because I just want to stay at home and be with my baby. Um, so in a sense, no job would ever satisfy that unless it was a job that I did for myself, like doing my own thing. And I had that really strong realization in November last year. I mean, I've always felt this way, but I feel like since having a baby, that's really catapulted that thought into my mind. And I just thought, I don't want to spend all the years of my son growing up working no you don't have to um like my job is not as labor intense as it used to be when i was in the consulting world but there's a certain amount of freedom i want to have in my life that i don't think any sort of job would give me unless it was a job that i created for myself so there's been many steps i have a lot of plans a lot of things i want to do to try and achieve that but one of the things that i wanted to give a fair shot was my sticker shop because it's always been a little business on the side that's been generating income quietly on the side and I thought if I really put myself into it I wonder how far I could take it I want to just make sure that I've exhausted it to the point where I'm like either it it, it, it do, does really well and I'm actually hoping it does really well because like and I'll share a little bit about how's it been going how's it been going <laughs> English good um, but also, if it wasn't going to go well, then it's something that I could at least cut loose, not waste my time on it anymore, sell off all my inventory, and then reinvest any of the money into another idea or something else that I want to do. <clears throat> Sorry, talking, dry throat. So around November, December, if you follow Happy Cloud Inc. or Beautiful Fable, you will have noticed a very, like, noticeable uptick in frequency and posting, especially on Instagram. I started a TikTok account, which I never thought I would, but here we are. And I actually am liking TikTok. Maybe I really am a Gen Z. Um, so I've been really enjoying that now. And I've been really f posting frequently. And it really has been kind of paying off. Like, I've had the sticker shop, so fully, full transparency, I've had the sticker shop five years now. And every year, it's been going down like this in terms of like sales and revenue and everything. And for the first time in five years, ever since I've opened it, it's doing this now. And I know it's because I'm investing myself more into it. And I just feel like if I keep going, it's just going to keep going. <laughs> Sorry, it is. Like, Bob's is sleeping right now. That's why I'm able to film this video. But it is late. Um, and so that's where all my time is going. Because I don't do the work until he's down for his night's sleep. I sometimes get to work in between naps. But quite honestly... Um, like Bub is on solid, so I spend a lot of time cooking for him, cooking with Tobias. Like Tobias and I both cook for the family together. It's cleaning, 
Bubs attends so many different classes now. I'm not sure how a nine month old has a busier schedule than me, but somehow it happened. And so you have to, there's a lot of time driving him to different classes and stuff like that. <clears throat> that might sound extreme to some people. When I say it out loud, it does sound a little bit extreme, but I, I think he's enjoying it. So anyways, that's a, this is a different topic to talk about. So yeah, the days are just really busy. So it's only the evenings and I don't want to spend hours and hours editing the fourth trimester video because that videos, those videos are like, I film most of them and they're like two to three hours worth of footage, which would mean I spend at minimum two to three hours editing it. And right now I just don't have the time for that. So that's why I don't think I'm going to be uploading it. <coughs> Moving forward videos that go on this channel. Well, I might upload the Cape Shank vlog, which I've filmed like back in November in 2022 just because that was the first trip that we took with Bubs, so it's kind of special. But moving forward, videos here are going to be a little bit less edited, more raw and transparent because that's the only way I can really do it right now. Um, and yeah, I hope that's okay. I mean, there's no other choice. But if you do want to see um, where my time and effort is going into, then yeah, A Beautiful Fable, Happy Clouding, all the links are down below. A lot of my time is going into that. Um, yeah, it's been going well. It's growing. I do have less than positive thoughts about some things that are happening, but I don't really want to spend too much time complaining either because I have to acknowledge how grateful I am to just firstly have the beautiful baby that I have, be in a position that I could take maternity leave, be in a country that supports maternity leave. Not even going to get into that, but yeah, that I, I could take a year off and I still have a job to go back to that I have the opportunity to run a small business as well. So I just try to remind myself that those are the things I should be focusing on, not the little drawbacks here and there. But yes, it's going up this way. Um, and if you're wondering, I do intend to go back to work. I think there's some coworkers that watch this vlog. I will be coming back to work. So <laughs> um, it's just more, this is like kind of a long-term plan and I've always been really nervous to say it out loud because I've always felt that I felt like it would it would take away opportunities in my day job if I was really honest about how I felt but I think by not being honest with myself like speaking it out honestly I have as a result been sort of sabotaging myself from really achieving the things I want to achieve so one of the things I promised myself is that I'm just gonna be honest I want to care less about who's watching what I put out there and what they think. Um, a great example is Fables and Fashion Instagram account. I used to pump out content like crazy and I have big regrets about stopping. Um, part of it is because too many people from my old job were watching me. Um, I had high school people and it is weird. <laughs> <laughs> when like your the girl who sat next to you in Matt's class is I don't know talking about something that you post online and you've not spoken to her in 20 years it is weird but you know what I'm gonna put those feelings aside because I don't want to hinder myself anymore so I'm just gonna be honest and I'm just not going to hide the truth so yeah that is where my time is going and I do have many more plans. I don't know if I'll share them on this vlog or other vlogs. I, I have no idea. Um, I have, yeah, more ideas that you will see coming up. I'm not talking about them specifically in this channel or not this channel, but in this vlog, just because I'm the sort of person that if I speak it out loud, then sometimes I feel like I've done it and then I don't have to do it anymore. So that's why I'm not talking about it. Um, but yeah, you may notice some vlogs go up on my planner channel. I am considering doing kind of like a planner vlog intertwine. I don't know if I've already said that, but because um, it's late and I'm like discombobulated right now. But I will still be doing vlogs on this channel. I just don't know what the frequency is going to be like. Um, but yeah, you may notice content changes there as well. So I think I've said everything I want to say. Oh, I do want to preface by saying that just because I'm like super focused on the Planet Channel does not mean you won't see content on all my other platforms like Fables and Fashion. Um, because 
doing that stuff is really fun for me like this vlog vlogging uploading stuff here it's really fun to me if i won the lotto today i would still be doing these sort of videos because i actually really enjoy them but i do want to make sure i prioritize my time accordingly so that the sticker shop gets the right amount of attention it needs so that i can get it to where it's going but it's been really good i have so many lessons learned um that i can't wait to share with everyone at some point i just kind of need to make everything more concise um, but I've been super motivated. I've been consuming copious amounts of content around the whole topic of business ownership and entrepreneurship. And I myself, having run the business for a few years and having run a YouTube channel that's been profitable and all that sort of stuff, I feel like I have a lot to talk about and share. So I definitely want to do that at some point, um, but just not right now because I actually need to... What do I need to do? Oh, I need to go design some stickers. Yeah, okay, I need to go design some stickers and I need to go to sleep. But I wanted to film this video and hopefully I won't need to edit it and I can just upload it. But yeah, so that is pretty much it. I don't want to ramble anymore. It's already been almost 12 minutes. So yes, thank you so much for watching. This is a recording for my family room. Ooh, back to you, internet.